I hear from a lot of people who are tired, who claim to be really tired from their lives these days and want to know what to do about it. One of the obvious answers is to go on vacation, right? Well, not necessarily. The problem for most people is that when they go on vacation, they take the very problems and issues and things that weigh them down with them and they come back just as tired, perhaps having been a little distracted for a few minutes, but just as tired as when they left. So I'd like to suggest something different. I'd like to suggest a stay-at-home vacation, sometimes called a staycation, but really making it a vacation by leaving behind, setting aside the issues, the problems, the things that confront you and weigh you down. You don't have to say goodbye to them forever, just for a little while just for a little while. And then you can find you actually can be recharged and refreshed. And the answer to all of that is to be found in the word vacation, which means to empty. When it comes to vacation, I often look up what does it actually mean to vacate. And what I realized when I looked up is actually taking a break from something you were doing before or previously whether it was a part of your routine or part of your daily ritual. And so when it comes to taking vacation, there are many ways one can do that, staying in the same place where they are. One of the ways is simply to do something that you don't usually do in your day-to-day -day life. For example, if you haven't done gardening in a long time, try that out. Or Indulge in something that you've been meaning to indulge for a long time, like pottery, or read a book. Take time out. A change in this way can be very productive, not only in your psychological life, but also in your spiritual development. We've been talking about going on vacation, or better yet, staying home for vacation, and refreshing ourselves and renewing ourselves by relieving ourselves of the kinds of baggage and concerns and problems that we usually have. That what, that's what makes a staycation a vacation, emptying ourselves from these kinds of activities. Fine, that's well said, but practically speaking, what can you do? What can you do right now to bring that kind of break and freshness into your life? Well, the first item, and I think it would be on everybody's list, is prayer and meditation. That's, that's number one and doesn't need any elaboration here. But also I'd like to suggest changing something. Changing as much as you can all of a sudden. Change your schedule, change your activities, change your priorities, change your preferences for literature or movie or activities. Rearrange your furniture. Spend some time outside instead of inside. Just change something and by doing so, you will get a different sense of yourself and your life and you can take more control and have more responsibility for being you and living your own life. Try it. Change something.